Now, if you've been following me for a while or you watched my first video, you know that Stitch actually started my love of collecting. So I'm gonna show you all of my Stitch Funko Pops, starting off with the first one, the one that kicked off the addiction, the one that made me want to be a Funko Pop collector. So this Funko Pop is Stitch with the Ducks and it is him just reading to the ducklings. I believe this scene is actually from the end credits um, of Lilo and Stitch the movie. Um, he's sitting there reading the ugly duckling book to them I don't think I need to really explain why. This one is my favorite. I think it is absolutely adorable. Um, it took me a really long time to get it because when I first started collecting, the thought of paying like $50 for a Fungo Pop to me just seemed crazy when they retailed for about 12, maybe 20 for a bigger one. Um, but obviously, as time went on, I understood value and I understood when, you know, something is vaulted. Um, so I definitely got to a point where I was like, okay, I need to get this Funko Pop. The next one I want to show you is this Flocked Stitch. It's actually a Target exclusive. Um, flocked, if you don't know, means that it's kind of like velvety. It's fuzzy. I don't know how to describe it, but I would say I would say fuzzy, which I think that works. Um, this is it's a different hue of blue than all the others because of this velvety texture, um, but it is really really cute. Next up, we've got Sleeping Stitch here. This is a Hot Topic exclusive. He is in his little pajamas. He's on a pillow. He's got his little stuffed animal there and he is peacefully sleeping. Um, I think this is just absolutely adorable and I had to have it. Next up, I've got Ukulele Stitch. Now this stitch here with the ukulele I think is adorable. Um, if you remember in the movie, he likes to play um, the different Elvis songs that come in it and I think this was a great addition. This one is common so it's not exclusive to anywhere, uh, but I actually really love this Funko Pop. Here's Monster Stitch. Now this is from the scene where he is destroying the little town that he builds in Lilo's room and having her watch. Um, I actually think this is a very accurate depiction of the movie. Um, I really actually love this this pop um, and this one is exclusive to FYE. This here is Hula Stitch. Um, there's actually a Lilo where she's also got the hula skirt and they're basically in the same pose but I, I actually don't have that one. Um, I really like this one. It is also a Hot Topic exclusive. This here is Summer Stitch. He is wearing his glasses and he's got a snow cone. Uh, very in theme for summer. Um, this one's actually a Hot Topic exclusive and it's scented. It smells like strawberries. This here is Superhero Stitch. This is actually one of my favorite ones, um, mainly because of the cape. They really caught it in action there. Uh, this one is a pop in a box exclusive. Um, this one might actually be one of my favorite regular sized pops of Stitch. Up next, we've got Gamer Stitch. Now this was an exclusive to GameStop, which makes a lot of sense in my opinion. Um, he's got some headphones and you can see he's got a little controller there um, with his tongue out. He's definitely concentrating on his game. This one is called Stitch 626. Um, if you've seen the movie, you know that he is Experiment 626. So this is very clear. He's as an alien. You could see all his different little alien features and he's got his alien outfit and the guns that he carries at the beginning of the movie. This here is Stitch as a Baker. Um, this is from the movie. He is holding that cake that he made for Lilo. Obviously in the movie, it looks much bigger, uh, but I think this is a really adorable Funko Pop. It's also got some weight to it. It's a little heavy. And this one comes from the 2020 Fall Convention. Here is a Stitch with the Boba Tea. Now this definitely isn't in the movie, but this really is an adorable Funko Pop. Um, I couldn't resist, even though it's not really part of the movie. Um, I don't believe it was ever in the show. Um, uh, but he's just so cute. Here is Stitch with the Rollers. Now this one actually came from the 2021 Fall Convention. Um, I don't remember this scene in the movie. I don't think it actually is part of it. Uh, but if you look at the little paper that he's holding, it's his badness level, uh, which that really is in the movie. Next up, we've got Annoyed Stitch. Now this one here, the name really kind of says it all. And I think it's a really accurate representation um, of the face that he has, like this expression. Very clear, he's annoyed. Um, I actually really love this scene in the movie. I think it's hilarious. Before I shift to some of the bigger pops, I did also wanna show you guys Lilo here. Um, she did come with Pudge. Um, I only have two of her Funko Pops. There is a few others, uh, but Stitch is the main focus of my collection. I did wanna have at least a couple of her. So we've got Stitch, or I'm sorry, Lilo with Pudge, and then we've got Lilo here with uh, Scrump. Uh, this one I think is pretty iconic given 
um, how hilarious her scenes are when she's talking about scrump. This here is a stitch in the bathtub. Um, there is a cute little duckling in the bath with him. You know how much I like those little ducks. Um, but this one was actually exclusive to the Hot Topic Expo um, that happened this year. Uh, it was the first time that they did it. So that sticker actually looks really cool. Next, we've got a bigger one. This is Lilo and Stitch on the hammock. Um, she's got a ukulele. She's got a flower in her hair. Next, we've got Stitch and the Rocket. Um, if you've seen this movie, if you love this movie, you know that this is a must-have. Uh, yes, in the movie, typically Lilo is on here with him, uh, but I really love this one. This is one that I actually came across randomly, um, and I wasn't planning on buying it, but the second I saw it, I had to have it. If you're familiar with the comic covers, the VHS covers, the movie posters, uh, Funko has been releasing lately. Um, I have this Stitch. Uh, this is a VHS cover. Um, I absolutely love these VHS covers. I collect the comic covers. Um, I think they are so cool, but they really do take up a lot of space um, given how much I love Stitch and how many Stitch Pops I have. I had to grab this one. It is exclusive to Amazon, as you can see there. This next pop is actually one that I looked for for quite some time. I ended up having a friend help me get this one, um, but it is Experience, Experiment 626, um, and he's in the dome. Now, this is absolutely adorable. Um, it is exclusive to Box Lunch, um, and I, I really like this pop. I think they did such a good job. It's so accurate, um, and it just fits perfectly in my collection. The next fungal pop is actually a Halloween themed fungal pop of Stitch. Um, this is a pumpkin Stitch. Um, I remember the day that this came out. The hype was crazy. I mean, look at him. He is absolutely adorable. Um, and then I also have this other um, vampire Stitch um, and he is really cute as well. I think this one is part of the movie. Um, I absolutely loved the theme ones. Um, I remember seeing them and just knowing that I needed to have them. I don't have them out year round just because they are for Halloween. The next two pops that I have are actually multi-packs. Um, I'll go ahead and show you this one first here. So this is Stitch, Angel, and Scrump. Um, if you're familiar with the TV show, um, Angel is, I guess, Stitch's partner. Um, and then Scrump is the doll uh, that Lilo carries around. This three pack is exclusive to Hot Topic, um, but I really actually love this one. It has lived in its box. I'm not sure why, not for any specific reason, I guess I would say. Um, and then we've got the Christmas uh, Stitch and Angel where they've got the Christmas hats. Um, I actually picked this one up. It's Hot Topic exclusive as well, uh, but I actually really like having this one and pulling them out around Christmas time as well. As you can see, the love for Stitch runs deep here and I'm not gonna be done collecting these anytime soon. Thanks again for stopping by. You guys have a great day.